Hi guys, it's Barry from Nods and White Water Sup. Today we're going to show you what can happen if your leash gets trapped into a branch on even the easiest moving water. We're all trained and we have put as much safety in as possible. Okay, you're just paddling along and all of a sudden some gets trapped. You tend to fall forward and you think you're all right. Then the power of the water takes effect. Your foot is now upstream and you're now having to try and reach against flowing water to release your ankle while the pressure of the water is now pulling you down. As you can see, um, I can actually get to my leash and uh, yeah. yeah, you'll see in a second. And that is why we don't use ankle leashes on rivers. This is from a different angle. I'm wearing a 70 Newton buoyancy aid and that should keep me afloat on any hard water. But the pressure is just still too much. My leg is upstream. I'm trying to reach. Every time I reach it pulls me deeper underwater. Yeah, still no go. <laughs> but I've drunk a lot of Trent. Hey. This time we're using a quick release system. Uh, this one is the HF Sup Buddy. Uh, it's a chest mounted system, so it's just a belt. As you can see, exactly the same fall off, but this time it flows me on my back, so it means that I float a lot higher up the water, and when the pressure gets too much, it automatically releases me. There's also a front release system that if you want to take it all off, it makes it easy. Thanks to Dean, James, Rob and Mark for being my safety team and hopefully I'll never see this in real life. Cheers, bye.